Ba-da! No handle, no correction. This dude is smart. I kid you not. Hey everybody, we are back for Thunder's next video. All right, what we're gonna be doing today is his first time in the field pointing birds standing steady. We have his belly collar on, his neck collar on. He has already made it through the steps of stand flush, stand shot, stop to flush, stop to shot. And we added some pretty cool, fancy um, bumper action in that. If you didn't see those videos, you need to go back and watch them because this is not step one. But this is our first se session, excuse me, out in the field. What we're going to be doing, I have launchers set up. Now I have multiple launchers in one place. This is going to be important. All of these things are like drills in, in sports. If you've ever played basketball maybe or something like that, where you stand in one place and you shoot or you do a layup, a simple, they're all simple things, okay? We've got to break this down into as small steps as possible so that we can move as quickly as possible for him. He is doing exceptionally well. So if you are trying to follow along with these videos and struggling with your dog, or at least seeing different things and have questions, make sure to reach out to us at patreon.com slash standingstonekennels. That's where we're set up to be able to help you one-on-one -on -one with your dog and its training. Now we're gonna get started up here. We need to check our wind. It's kind of coming this way, which would be out of the Northeast. We're gonna make a little loop with him. He's gonna lock up on point, hopefully. <laughs> Um, and then, once he is, uh, has established point, I'm gonna put myself up near the birds like I'm flushing, but it's also gonna help me to be kind of in the forefront of his mind with dad's here, dad's been throwing birds at me, now the birds are coming out of the ground, but dad is still here, okay? This makes a small step for him to be able to help him to be successful. My guess is he may try and move. He's been very steady in the yard, this is where we've been shooting birds. He's been able to break all of those things. So this is a big jump, but once he handles that first bird, if he moves, we'll stop him. If he doesn't move, we're gonna launch another one, work through it, and then adjust as we need to. Follow along here, heel. Okay, let's go, hunt him up. It's pretty normal for dogs, okay, to be a little bit sticky, a little bit different to begin with, wearing that belly collar. Okay, hunt him up. Good, let's go, bud. Don't be surprised, these are those simple drills. It doesn't look like the real deal yet. All right, you got an eye on him here. He's a good distance off the birds. We have some good wind. I'm gonna get a, um, a thumbs up. Can you get everything in one view there? All right, so I'm on the birds. What I'm gonna go ahead and do, I've got my finger on the button. This is to be able to help him if I need to make a correction. We wanna get him stopped sooner rather than later. And then here comes bird number one. Oh, ba-da. No handle, no correction. This dude is smart, I kid you not. These have been sitting out here waiting on me for a little bit, so I need to wake them back up if they kind of go to sleep to save battery. Now, just because, folks, um, when you have opportunities to work with your steady dogs, it's fun to come in here and take some pictures of them. Yeah, Bubba. Doing their thing, looking pretty. Make sure and take time for that as long as it doesn't disrupt your session. All right, now we're coming in on bird number two. Ah, there was our mistake. No, Bubba. Okay, collar on his belly. All of these different things are part of it. So what we're, go what we're doing here, moving toward is advanced steadiness toward testing. And there's gonna be hurry up and wait scenarios. There's gonna be situations that are gonna set him up to be, ah, this wasn't a perfect scenario. So we work through everything. Now, on to launcher number three. This is kind of the importance of having multiple birds here. There goes a the bird, and zero handle on that one, folks. 
That's a really good deal. Now, let me go ahead and grab him and I'll come back up and we'll kind of walk through this as well as where we're gonna be moving next. Whoa. I always come in, no, whoa. Come in and heal our dogs away. Heal, heal, good. How did that happen? Ouch. Okay, heal. Good. All right, so all of these things here, this is going to be what a typical session would look like. I'm not going to do more. Ah, heal. Good. Distractions, young dog, this is all part of it. What we had there was really, really good, okay? He came in on that first bird. He stood it, made it look too easy. Um, me coming in, taking a picture of him, giving him a little bit of time to think and stand, allowed for that mistake to happen. Now, we're not trying to get our dogs to make mistakes, but we do need to challenge them and set them up for additional challenges as we go. Um, the next bird that came out, he tried to take off after it. I stopped him, belly collar only at this point. That's why we're still using it. He stopped pretty easy, then out came the third bird. That's why it's important to have multiple birds in the same area there. All of that happening makes a really good progression for stand steady, be ready, there may be another bird coming, which can all be things that are gonna happen in the test down the road for him. He um, did really well with that. I would say we may do one more session just like this, and I would guess he won't move at all. If that's the case, then we'll move into his next, um, his next step, and that will be running through finding individual birds in different places. That makes it more challenging. We move from new place to new place to new place instead of all standing in one place here, okay? Uh, also, we will be doing some backing drills. We're actually gonna utilize this setup for that. That'll be in a separate video. Definitely follow along, like, subscribe, uh, so that you can keep up with Thunder. I'm the guy with the pink gun. Thunder, we just mentioned him, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.